Yo, what's going on, Selective Fam? Welcome back to a brand new video on our channel, you guys. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to Parents Sell Daughter for Cybertruck. <laughs> what happens is shocking gloomably. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to give a like, subscribe if you're new, share the video, comment in the comment section down below. We're going to bring out lots more illum illumably content to you guys. I'm sorry, this title <laughs> is crazy. Made me laugh, bro. I'm not laughing that they're selling their daughter. I'm laughing that, like, bro, how's this a thing? I know cyber trucks are crazy expensive, bro. Like, they're crazy. But, bro, what? Selling your daughter for a cyber truck is wild. Anyways, uh, we're gonna jump in it, guys. This video was out 10 days ago, kind of recent. Let's just jump in it, bro. Record, recording in three, two, one. Record. No, bro, there's no way. There's just no way this is real. My gosh. But here we go. Let's 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 see what happens. Alright now keep your eyes closed. Oh my gosh, it's bro, I always say this every time I see this actor, bro. I'm sorry for pausing it three seconds in. But this guy looks like Larry Bird. Tell me I'm not wrong. Tell me I mean tell me I'm wrong, bro. Or tell me I don't know how the saying goes. But bro, doesn't he look like Larry Bird? Oh my gosh. Is this is he gonna play evil role in this? Because bro, they're gonna sell their daughter, so I don't recognize the wife actress, but like and I think I know who this is, even though she's blindfolded. I think I could tell, but... Listen seen... to your father, sweetheart. Okay, okay, Mom. Sure? But what is it? Is it a car? Or better yet, are we going on vacation? Or a house? Kinda. Sorta. Except, we're gonna have to tie up your hands. We don't want you to get so excited that you put your fingerprints all over the surprise. If you know... What's going on here, bro? I'm not lucky how this is going. 21 seconds in this video! You're tying your daughter's hands? What are you gonna do? Bro, what is happening right now? What I mean, uh, I guess fingerprints. Oh, it has to be something crazy. Yeah. This oh, is it weird. Is. This is weird. This is no, no, no. This might be the thumbnail, bro. What? Are, what are you doing to her? Nah, bro. They're tying her hands for a reason. And it's not a good thing. Ready? What is going on? That's insane, that's insane, that's this insane. Bro, look at this. Ta -da! That's crazy, bro. That that looks like from the future, bro. Jeez. Uh, oh my gosh, are you serious? This is for me? You guys are the best parents ever! Oh. Mm, is it for her, though? Who the heck are you? What is happening, bro? I'm so lost. Mom, who the hell is that? Yeah, who? That's my reaction. Uh, Dad. Uh, this is gonna sound like we're awful people, but honey, you tell her. Sweet. Here we go. This is your new husband, or excuse me, or bestie, or whatever you want to call it. We traded you for a cyber truck. How amazing is that? No and There's not no. only do we get a new member to our what? family, but we get a new car. No way, and this not is just real. Any car, the car, the cyber truck. It's made of steel and it's fast. Calm down, buddy. <laughs> Look at this truck. It's made of steel and it's fast, really fast. Calm down, buddy. It's fast! What the heck was that? <laughs> My gosh. I've seen this guy. I've reacted to a lot of Illumably videos with this guy, and I've never seen him act like this. Clearly, he loves cyber trucks. <laughs> are you guys freaking out of your minds? They are. Well, it's all yours. Pleasure doing business with you. What the well, heck, bro? Aren't you handsome? What's See, the, sweetheart. What was the point of tying your hands? I'm not understanding. Oh. This is good. The two of you can give us beautiful grandbabies. Ew, no, disgusting. Hell to the no. Listen, I don't Sandy, blame her. Stop being a little brat and chop chop. You Damn. You can go now. Chop chop? Really, buddy? Really? You're an adult and you've been living with us a long time. This is good for you and it's good for us. You're only... No, it's not good for her. You're doing only you're only doing this so you can get a freaking cyber truck. You don't care about your daughter. What? We get a new cyber truck. Your dating life isn't as boring as you. 
It's a win-win situation what? for everyone. Thank you, Chase, for the opportunity to trade our daughter for this car. It's now that's messed up. We love it. Now that is messed Take up, care, bro. Both of you. Bye, sweetheart. Bro. Hi. They they showed more love to their car. They didn't even give you a hug, a kiss, none of that. They just said, bye, sweetheart. Oh, and look how they react to the Cybertruck. Show more affection to the Cybertruck than their own daughter. How nice is that? Wow. By the way, if you didn't tell, that was sarcasm. Hi. My name's Chase. But I don't chase. I only attract. Wow. Oh, my gosh. This guy. Ew. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Sandy. And even if you did chase, I would not be attracted. I'm kind of at a loss for words right now because my parents just traded me to a rando for a cyber truck. Facts. Do you even know who this guy is, bro? Like, I guarantee you these parents don't even know who this guy is, bro. Who Chase? Who's Chase, bro? You traded your daughter to a random dude for a cyber truck. Put, guys, put that in perspective. These parents traded their daughter to a random person for a cyber truck. My gosh. I'm sorry. I can't get over that. It's good. Well, when you say it like that, it sounds pretty insane. But It, it is insane. A deal's a deal. That's and crazy, bro. Don't worry. I don't bite. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. No way you just said that. Oh my god. <laughs> there is actually no way you just did that. Don't worry. I don't bite. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was... Yeah, look at her face, bro. I'm like, bro. No way. Yeah, this is the worst day of my life. I don't blame you. took my car, we're gonna need to walk. <sighs> I can't believe my parents did this to me. I mean, what kind of people are they? Messed up people? I don't even know how to process this. I know this is probably the most insane thing that's happened to you ever. Oh, uh, yeah. I just Very. remember... Parents do stuff for their own reasons. That's and true. At the end of the day, they still love you. Um, yeah, what you just witnessed is not love. Exactly, what you just witnessed is not love. What do you mean? They don't love you. If they traded you for a cyber truck, they don't love you. They love the cyber truck more than you, actually. Like, I'm sorry, but that's the truth. Just witness. It's, it's not, not love. love. Facts. There you go. They're greedy. They're greedy. I mean, what kind of parents just give their kid to a stranger because they want to be free? Okay, relax. That's I true. I'm sorry, what was your name? It's Sandy. It's nice to meet you, Sandy. Who is this guy, though, bro? Like, I'm curious. Like, is he a good genuine dude or is he does he have evil intentions so we see uh, you guys don't even know who this guy is you just traded your daughter for all you know this guy could be crazy maniac look there she is yeah you think she's gonna hate us she might but you know this could be good for her yeah maybe she even fall in love with the guy hopefully anyways bro not our problem anymore now let's check out this car there is actually Zero no to a million. really the fact you said not our problem anymore it's insane that's your own daughter are you guys really? Oh, they're the worst parents, bro. That's crazy. That's a good house, bro. So, welcome to your new home. That's um, crazy. It's nice. Wow, this house is beautiful. But you have to pretend like you don't like it. You're angry. Oh. So, are you hungry? Or want something to drink? I've got water, Gatorade. Sure. And he seems Gatorade genuine. Good. He seems genuine right me? now. Or is he being really sweet? He's being really nice no. to you, but... No, 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 no. You hate him. Snap out of it. She's developing feelings. Who knows? She might actually develop feelings for the guy. You never know, guys. Maybe this Maybe this could have been... I don't know. Guys, Illumably has the most craziest twists like, in like a lot of their videos. So I don't know if there's going to be a crazy twist to this. But right now, he seems very genuine. So I don't know. Are they going to actually fall in love? Are they going to actually become a couple? Are they going to get married? We don't know. But there could also be a possibility that doesn't happen. We don't know, guys. We're only four minutes in. So, uh, you take the master bedroom tonight. I'll okay. sleep on the couch. Okay, he's being oh, very no, nice. I can sleep on the couch. It's your place. No, it's fine. I want you to be comfortable. Okay. This is a new space for you. 
That's very nice. That's a gentleman move right there. That he's saying, like, I'll take the couch, you take the master bedroom. But she's, like, she's not being, like, a like a snotty person saying, oh, you, thank you, I'll take it. Or, no, no, not like that. But, like, you guys know what I mean. Like, she's saying, like, oh, I'll take, oh, pff, good. Like, she's not being, like, overly, like, well, greedy. You know what I mean? Like, she's like, no, nah, it's okay. Like, it's your place. But, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. I'm kind of tired, so I think I'm gonna get some rest. I think she's falling in love, bro. She did her hair like that. I think she's falling in love, dude. She's not admitting it yet. I don't know. I don't know, guys. It, I mean, from what it looks like, it's a very nice house. He looks. He seems genuine right now. So we're gonna have to wait and see. I just wish I knew why my parents wanted to give me away to a stranger. Even That's crazy. The seems so gentle and sweet. He it seems. doesn't make sense. Because they wanted a cyber truck. Bro, you can get a cyber truck without trading your daughter, bro. Like, fam, what? Okay, let's see what happens here. A few hours later. Okay, she took a nap, looks like. Oh. Meet me at the Illum Illuma Bar. <laughs> Illuma Bar, that's funny. I like it. 7 o'clock p.m. The driver will pick you up. Chase, oh, so this guy's rich. Clearly he's rich, but he has a cyber truck. Okay, so, interesting. I mean, he put a note by her bed, so meet me at the Luma Bar, but why then? Oh, he even gave her a dress? Interesting. Wait, why does he have a dress, though? This is so gorgeous. Why does he have a dress? Did he but buy it for her? my size. When did he get it? Mm. Oh, that's kind of interesting, guys. Oh, no. That's red. I don't know. Is that a red flag, bro? This guy knew her size. And when did he get it? Yeah, that's true. I don't know. Is that a red flag? Guys, is that a red flag? Tell me that. I don't know. How do you know her size, though? That's the thing. Mm, I don't know, guys. I'm getting mixed feelings about... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm so confused. I'm just as confused, but I can't wait to find out what happens. The driver will pick you up. Bro, I'm like, I I'm looking, I'm like, I don't know, I don't know, bro. I'm just, I'm excited to find out what happens here. I, I did not see this video. Uh, she says yes. I really like her. Oh, he's gonna, what? Oh, he's gonna ask her. He's gonna ask her to, I think he's gonna propose. He's gonna propose. Already? Bro, you guys just met though. But I don't know. I don't know, guys. Uh, she says yes. I really like her. Look, bro, he has a violinist. He... Whoa. You look stunning, Sandy. Thank you. I'm so confused. How did you get this dress and figure out my size? And did you decorate this place by yourself? I'll give you all the answers after I ask you a question. What do you mean? I know we just met. I know this is crazy, but I believe in love at first sight. And I believe that even though we're strangers, we won't be for long. And I think everything happens for a reason, right? I agree with that, but I don't know, So will you take that leap of faith, that jump, and do me the honor of becoming my wife, Sandy? Guys, I don't know. I don't know. He seems genuine. He's doing this, all this preparation. It seems, it looks so cool. You know, he got this, uh, the decoration set up with the roses. He has a violinist. But like, I don't know. But marrying? J Bro, you guys just met that day. You guys just met literally the, that morning, I think. Right? Marriage right away? I don't know. Typically, you guys, you know, you and your partner, you go on dates, you know, you try to get it, to know each other better. You know, you go on a first date, bro. They have just met that day. And Sandy doesn't even know who this guy is, bro. Deep down. We don't know. And he didn't even answer the questions yet. What? I mean... <sighs> I'm sorry, Chase. I barely know you. That's what I was going to say. And marriage is a really big deal to me. Oh my god, look at this guy's face. I barely know you. Look at this guy's face. marriage is a really big deal to me. 
good. <laughs> he's like, he's like, damn, this is awkward. But bro, look at his face. <laughs> look at his face. This is just a lot. I need to think about it. I need to go. I just. Fine. Just so you know, I'm going to try every day to get you to fall in love. Because I already have. Damn, bro. I don't know, like, I don't think he did it with evil intentions. He's like, yeah, I don't know. What After that day he proposed to me, something happened. Days went by and I couldn't help but feel these small butterflies blooming in my stomach. You're falling Since in love with him. Since the moment my parents abandoned me, he was all I had. That's true. Look at that violin, bro. Or in the background, I like that. He was that. all that I really needed. He showed me the feeling of love, the feeling of not being scared to take the leap of faith, even if we were wow. strangers. Okay, so I guess maybe it's not evil intentions. We're eight minutes in out of twelve. Maybe it's not evil intentions. Maybe he genuinely loved. He genuinely loved her, and you know he wanted to take that leap of faith. You know, like say like, look, like I don't know how you feel, but this is how I feel. So maybe he doesn't have evil intentions, and I thought he did because I know illuminably sometimes they have their freaking twists, bro. So I don't know, but it looks like it's genuine, bro. So and she's she's falling in love with him too. He showed me the meaning of courage to put your heart on the line, even if it may be rejected. I don't um, know. This sounds crazy, but I guess I am in love with Chase. There you go. There. Oh, she's going to do it to him. Oh, my God. You were right, Chase. After all these months, I've gotten so close to you. I think he was the, he was the guy that went crazy at the gender reveal. <laughs> this is a complete opposite role from the one he's playing before. And I remember when you proposed to me, you told me that I was gonna fall in love with you. Well, so, right? Look how happy you got, so bro. So you do the honors, Chase Montgomery, of being my husband. Wow, she's proposing yes. to him. Yes. Oh my God, I love you. I love you too. Oh, and they look really good together too. Congrats. We're getting married. Oh my gosh. So exciting. See, it just took, it just, like, because he chased it right away. But then, you know, it took her time, feel, time, but she started developing feelings for him too. Who was that? That's a surprise for you. Oh, her parents? I think. I'm assuming, but the parents, why would they come? Hey, oh, sweetie. I guess I was. Hey. Bunches? Honey bunches? Mom, Dad, what are you doing here? We're here to congratulate you on your new engagement. Congratulations, honey. Wait, what? I'm so confused. Well, why don't you take a seat and we'll explain everything. What is going on, bro? I love your new dress, honey. It's so pretty. Listen, sweetheart. We never wanted to give you away. This is it. Your father and I have been married for 35 years now. That's crazy, wow. And we got married in our 20s. And you're over 30 years old, and you haven't found the love of your life. And obviously, as your parents, this really concerned us. Mm, okay. We wanted you to be happy and but, experience the same love we have. Yeah, but the way you guys went about it, though, selling your daughter for a Cybertruck, it didn't seem like you loved her at that time. Bro, like you guys got so enamored with the cyber truck, it seems like you didn't even care about your daughter. Come on now. And for that reason, we took some drastic measures. They're very drastic, Wait, bro. So you didn't want to actually trade me for the cyber truck? No. Wow. I mean, okay. Then respect to the parents, I guess. They didn't want they, didn't, but they seemed so in love with the cyber truck. Were they acting then? I know they're acting in the video, but bro, were they acting like they liked the cyber truck? I don't understand. That. That's for crazy. all these months, I've just been. Thinking that you guys hated me and you didn't love me anymore. Mm -hmm. I oh, love yeah. you, sweetheart. So you guys yeah. just wanted me to experience the kind of love you share. And that's when they reached out to me. Oh, wow. They found me on a dating app. And they explained this whole crazy plan to me. And at first, I was Damn. not on board. So it was a setup. So it was a setup. Damn, bro. But then I realized they were just looking out for you. I feel bad for her, though. And since my parents passed, oh. I would do anything to go back in time and listen to their words of wisdom. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry, son. Yeah. Wait, so I don't get it. You guys were all in on this this whole time. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's met, crazy. And I felt this connection I'd never felt before. Wow. And that energy made me think that you might 
be the one. And after these last few months, that's awesome. Looking at where we are now, they got married. I know you're the one, Sandy. Wow. <laughs> because you were all in on this i don't blame a part of me under i don't blame her for thinking that bro because she thought it was a crazy scheme by the parents to get rid of her and now she's like oh we love you no it's just said i understand her frustration stands because i know i haven't been the most open to love mm, there you go so i probably wouldn't have listened so mom dad thank you for introducing me to the love of my life. And I guess it worked out in the end, right? She found the love of Chase. her life. <laughs> Thank you for giving me the courage to follow my heart. We love you, sweetie. What a happy and ending. we're so happy that you found your happily ever after. Oh, <laughs> and about the cyber truck, you both can have it back as an engagement No game. way. <laughs> That's crazy. Champagne. Okay, double oh, parents. Yeah. Double parents. <laughs> Wow. This will be a good story to tell my kids. I fell in love with their dad because their grandparents treated me for a cyber truck. That's crazy. That'll be a story to tell, bro. The universe has such a weird way of bringing people who are meant to be. It really does, bro. Together. It really does. God always has a plan, bro. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, that was actually insane. The title was wild. Um, but good happy ending, bro. I didn't I thought, bro, I genuinely thought the parents did not like their daughter because they treated her for a cyber truck. And they seem like they love the cyber truck more than her, which is wild. But and everything worked out in the end. Everything worked out in the end. You know, Sandy found the love of her life. You know, Chase, I I was getting him some red flags, especially after he knew her dress size and everything. But I guess he's a genuine dude. So respect to Chase. And yeah, and their parents found him on a dating app. A dating apps, bro, like they're kind of, they could be sus. They could, it could be sus, bro. You don't know who you're going to meet. But in this case, it did work out. So, happy for them. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.